Welcome to this video about the AI ChatGPT. In this video, we're gonna explain what ChatGPT is, how it works, and some tips and tricks to get you up to speed in using it quickly and efficiently. And make sure you stick around to the end because there is a huge surprise. First, let's talk about what ChatGPT is. ChatGPT is a large language model trained by OpenAI. It's capable of generating human-like text according to the responses that you give it. A language model like ChatGPT is essentially a form of artificial intelligence that's trained on large data sets of human text, where it can learn the patterns of human-generated language, mimic those type of patterns, and come back to you with a response that matches the similar human style of communication. Now let's dive into how you can use ChatGPT and some quick tips and tricks to get some value out of it quickly. To get started using ChatGPT, first you need to go to chat.openai.com, which is the fastest way to get to the login and sign up page. You will have to create a free account to use this tool and keep in mind that the sign up as well as login pages might be a little bit finicky as there's so much traffic to this tool at this time, but I'm sure that will get better. Once you've created an account and logged in, the page is really simple to use. You'll notice on the left-hand side, there's a handful of things such as dark mode, their discord updates, and the ability to reset your chat thread. And then the bulk of the page is filled up with suggestions about the examples, capabilities, and limitations of the chat tool. To use ChatGPT, you simply go to the chat bar, type in a question or a prompt, click submit, and watch it work. For example, I wanted to have three different ideas of meals I can cook for dinner tonight and got back spaghetti with sauce and meatballs, grilled chicken and roasted vegetables, and a veggie stir fry with brown rice. Now, there's a few things that I can do from here. I can either continue to type in more prompts into the chat bar, or I can click the try again button to generate a new response. You can see that lots of the times it will be generating these responses and coming back to the text in real time, which is actually a feature I love. And so simply trying again on that same prompt, it listed out three different recipes, but this time it also included all of the instructions that I might need to cook all of these recipes. So using ChatGPT is super simple. But now that we've discussed a little bit how you can start using it, let me share a few tips for how I've been able to generate really great responses. The first tip that I have is just start by asking simple general questions. This will get you in the habit of asking these questions, using the tool and generating responses in a way that can be pretty fun. So like my first question was, what can I have for dinner tonight? Another fun question could be, what's something fun I can do on my birthday? And as you can see, this generates a list of potential things that I can do on my birthday, and then even explains why those are things that would be fun to do on your birthday. Another useful tip is be as specific as you can and give helpful context. You'd be surprised how the answers will change based off the context you give it. So we can enhance the birthday example in this case. So now I'm giving it the prompt, I'm a person that likes spending time in nature with my dogs, which is useful context. Can you give me four ideas of what I can do on my birthday? This is taking the initial birthday prompt, giving it some extra context about me, and then giving it the instruction that I only want four suggestions. So now based off that additional context, it has generated four ideas that I can enjoy on my birthday with my dogs, such as go on a hike in a nearby park or forest, visit a lake, plan a camping trip. If you live in the city, go to a dog park, etc. Another tip for using ChatGPT quickly and effectively is try to be really specific about the output that you're wanting. So if you want a list, tell it to generate a list. If you want an essay, tell it to generate an essay. Whenever you give it these additional instructions, ChatGPT will be smart enough to understand how it should format its response. So in this prompt, I said, I want a bulleted list of five video ideas about how to use ChatGPT. And it gives me five video ideas in a bulleted list. Another fun formatting output is to have chat give answers in the forms of types of poetry. So for example, I'm having it write a haiku about how cool ChatGPT is. And here is our haiku, ChatGPT, so cool. Nature's language it emulates human-like chatbots. Okay, I have two more tips. ChatGPT is really excellent for brainstorming and helping you come up with a list of ideas that you can further explore. So for example, I'll ask it, can you help me brainstorm a few different business ideas that generate passive income? And now I have a handful of ideas such as renting properties, investing in stocks, creating and selling courses, starting dropshipping businesses, and building an affiliate network. 
as a list of ideas that can act as a starting point. Keep in mind, these might not be the absolute best answers, but this is a generative list that can help you start to research more. Which brings me to my last point of the day. It is really powerful to ask questions about the answers that the chat is giving you. So as part of these passive income business ideas, it mentioned drop shipping businesses. And so what I'm going to do is use the chat to dig deeper onto what a drop shipping business is. So I'm gonna ask it the question, what is a drop shipping business? Now that I understand what a drop shipping business is, I'm gonna ask it, what are three products I could use for a potential drop shipping business? And now I have a list of items that I could start a drop shipping business with. But let's take this one more step further. Finally, I'm going to ask it to generate a brief business plan based off of drop shipping furniture. And here we go. It is generating the business plan for drop shipping furniture as we speak. So now we have a business plan called Furniture Drop, where we're drop shipping furniture. It includes an overview, market analysis, products and services, marketing and sales strategies, as well as financial projections. Of course, this AI can't go out and do this, so the rest of this drop shipping business relies on my shoulders. Overall, ChatGPT is a powerful tool that allows you to generate human-like text responses quickly and easily. And we are just now seeing the beginning of this type of technology and all of the implications and the ways that you can use this in productive and meaningful ways. So whether you're a writer, researcher, or just someone who's curious about AI and how ChatGPT works, it is definitely worth checking out. And now for the big surprise. I use ChatGPT to generate the script for this YouTube video. Let me read my prompt word for word. Can you create a script for a YouTube video describing how users can get up to speed on what ChatGPT is, how it works, and how to begin using it quickly in a productive way? And that prompt generated the entire video that you watched here today. So ChatGPT is truly a crazy technology. I have been loving using it even over just the last few days, and I hope this video was helpful. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, I would love if you could give it a thumbs up as that helps me out a ton. Feel free to comment below some of the favorite prompts that you have used, and it would mean a ton to me if you could give my channel a subscription. Let me know if there's any type of content that you wanna see going forward, kind of like this video. But other than that, Thank you for watching and thank you for keeping it real with Ryan.